Hello everybody, hope you well, hope you're fantastic. My name is Gavin Mkabela. Now in this video, I want to talk about paid up properties, right? So it means that you don't owe anybody, don't owe the bank, um, you now own this property 100%. So this could be because you had a mortgage bond or you had a loan with the bank and you, you paid it over time and it's now complete, you now have your title deed or you bought a vacant stand, uh, a vacant land and you built in the, on that land and now that property belongs to you. So you could have used your own money, you could have had a loan, whatever it is, but you now have a title deed. Now what I see sometimes being a problem is that people when they now, you know, they're finished paying off their mortgage bonds or, you know, they've, they've finished building, they're building this, uh, you know, this property, that dream house, um, it could be an investment property where you now have tenants renting that property is that at times people feel that insurance is not necessary now you know when we, when we look at things look at the way things are especially now um, you know accidents happen all the time guys accidents happen all the time and now we are faced with issues such as load shedding where now maybe you are cooking and the electricity goes off and you forget to switch off the stove you go to work now what would happen if now you know an accident happens maybe there's a spark or you finished the, you know you didn't switch off the stove uh, something catches fire and then their house burns down now how are you going to now rebuild that property that you have worked so hard you know to either finish paying it off or worked so hard to save up money to then build you see now the problem there right so what i'm trying to say with this video is let us start to think about these things right let us start to think about accidents that can happen and we find ourselves in trouble because now our properties are bent down right so we need to now be able to revisit that and i think one of the the, the most important thing that one can do if you are in that situation right now is to really call up somebody within the insurance space you know it could be a broker it could be a financial advisor and then they can be able to sit down with you and really look at where you are and see how they can tailor make you know a, a, you know a package that can be able to uh, be able to suit you but i really really encourage you know if you are in that space or you know somebody that is in that space to really start to think about insurance in a different light because at the end of the day you don't want to see your hard work going up in smoke now we're not saying that it's going to happen but you know there's, there's always chances that it might happen so now to cover yourself you need to make sure that at least you have something that if anything goes wrong um, i can then be able to rebuild my property again now I know of course there is a sentimental aspect to it you know the, your, your house you know you finish paying it off you, you finish building it you know it, 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 it there's, there's this sentimental veil so when something goes wrong and maybe it bends down of course you're going to be devastated but at least if there is you know an option for you to be able to rebuild again you know it, it's better than if now you know you it, that memory basically of your property will just be exactly that because it would have been bent down and maybe you might not recover ever again so with this i really just want to encourage you like start to think about that a little bit to say what if something goes wrong you know and things go wrong right uh, all the time so what if something goes wrong how can how will i be able to rebuild my property so make sure that you're starting to think about that and really start to now get help for somebody that can and assist you to put together maybe a, a you know a package for you that can suit your pocket and suit your needs and i think with this uh, video as well i also just want to encourage um you know us who maybe have family homes you know their parents um they finished paying off this property and uh, many months ago and again it did the same scenario you know will also apply because what if something goes wrong and maybe we can cover them and of course you know this video is not you know uh, you know taking from a, a position of being naive to, to understand that people are, a lot of people are struggling you know to even cover basic stuff but if you are in that position you know to pay that little premium that can then give you a peace of mind please please be able to do that because you don't want to find yourself in trouble where something goes wrong and now you don't have money to rebuild you are going to go to a mental institution basically think about it you know all these years you are sacrificing 
and now you are seeing you know your your your, your property your beloved house going up in smoke and there's nothing you can do about that so i just wanted to encourage you right encourage everybody else if you know somebody you might not even you might not be in that position you might know somebody your parents you know your family whoever you know just be able to maybe have that discussion or show them this video so that they start to think about this differently and hopefully they can take action now i hope that there's some way somehow it assists and 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 maybe just to also cover them um, this part that it, it's if there's different insurances of course when it comes to property you know there's building insurance and there's issues around you know life insurance and for those that you know you you have taken a, a loan and and maybe something goes wrong you, you you pass away you also want to make sure that that loan will be settled you know for the sake of your family that will be left behind so let us start engaging with professionals around the insurance space that can help us to then be able to you know put together a good package for for us but also then to give us a peace of mind knowing that every day if anything goes wrong yes i'll be devastated because my property is now you know up in smoke but at least i know that there will be funds that we uh, can use to then rebuild again anyway i hope that you're going to have a, an amazing and incredible day and please 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 don't forget to press that red button to subscribe and also share these videos with as many people as possible because we are trying to empower people uh, so that they can be able to start thinking differently and hopefully take action which is very very important anyway as i said my name is gavin mkabela i am signing out see you on the